Hey loves and welcome back to my channel. So today I will be talking about my favorite makeup products. So I'll be talking about makeup and also my favorite makeup brushes. So without further ado, let's get into the video. And don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of my content. So we're going to go in order starting with eyes. So what this is my favorite eyebrow product and this is from Anastasia Beverly Hills and this is their dip brow and this is in the color dark brown. I love this product. This is my go-to eyebrow product. Dip brow is more for the advanced makeup users. Um, if you're a beginner in makeup then I would suggest using a pencil because you have a little more control and it's not as intense. Dip Brow is a very pigmented product, so a little goes a long way and you don't want to be too heavy handed with it, but you get so much product. Um, this was only $29, I believe. I got this like a few years ago and like I have so much product left. As you can see, I still have a lot of product left so this is a really good investment it's a really good dip brow and i would highly recommend getting this and to apply my dip brow i use my eyebrow brush and this is oh, this eyebrow brush i had this for years now i got this from forever 21 i got it in like a makeup kit um i don't have any of the other brushes anymore but this one definitely stuck around and this is like the best eyebrow brush ever. I'm telling you, I'm telling you. Um, I'm not sure if they still sell this kit. I'm not sure what the kit's called, but I know I got this from Forever 21 for sure. So I'm pretty sure they probably have other eyebrow brushes you can buy, but I just love this brush so much. Now we're gonna move into eye base. LA Girl Pro Concealer is an OG product of mine. Um, it's very affordable. It's only like a dollar or two and it just does the job. I really like to conceal under my brows with this product. And I like to use a lighter color on my lids just to cancel out the color on my eyes when I do my eyeshadow makeup. So I definitely recommend this product. As for my base, I love to use the P. Louise base, and this is Rumor 3. Now, P. Louise is low key canceled, but I still love this base. Like, this base is awesome. I just use it on all my makeup looks. So, she's canceled, but this product's bomb. Um, I have two so I won't have to buy again from her because she just did some out-of-pocket stuff but I do like this product. For eyeshadow, this is my favorite palette. Now this is the Morphe 39A Dare to Create palette and I love this palette. I'm just going to show you guys the inside to see what I'm talking about. As you can see, you get all these beautiful colors. The pink on top is such a nice color. I use it in mostly all of my colorful looks. And it just gives you so much variety. You have shimmers, you have mattes, and you have the big pans in the middle, which can be used for contour and also for kind of like a highlight under the eye. So I like to use this shade to bronze with, and this is just such a nice warm bronze color for me. So I really just love this palette so much, and I would definitely say you should get this palette. Now moving on to foundation. Now if you already follow me on Instagram, you know this is my favorite foundation. I use this in like all of my makeup look. This is the Maybelline Dream Velvet Foundation and this one is in coconut. This one is in caramel, sorry. And this one is in coconut. So I like to use the coconut one as a foundation and I've been using the caramel one as a concealer because it is a few shades lighter. And this, oh, my skin just looks so nice. I just love this foundation so, so much. 
makes your skin look so good it has like a nice little velvety touch so it's not matte it's not dewy it's like a nice velvet mousse in between and I just love this foundation so definitely get you this and as always all the products that I mentioned will be in the description box down below as far as blending out my foundation and concealer I like to use these two products right here this sponge is the Sonia Kasha sponge and like I said in my last video this is only seven dollars and this is the best beauty blender I ever use it gets so big it blends everything nicely so you don't have to pay $20 or whatever how much a normal beauty blender is you can just get this one and it's just so good and I got this from Target so you can definitely find this at Target I'm pretty sure you could probably find it at Walmart as well but you have to get this you have to get this definitely an essential in my makeup routine so I use this brush to blend out my concealer sometimes but I definitely like to use this to blend out my eye base this is the elf concealer brush and guys this is only three bucks and it's so good I really like this for concealer because it gets to the inner corner of my eye unlike the sponge wood because it's kind of big so this can get right into the corners to blend and I really love to blend my eye base out because it just fits on my eye perfectly and this is just the best brush ever like elf makes the best brushes elf and wet and wild a1 brushes you don't have to spend hundreds of dollars buying brushes this is only three dollars like and this is awesome so I would definitely recommend getting this brush so let's talk about face powders and these two are my favorite so this face powder is the black radiant soft focus powder and this is in milk chocolate and guys I love this powder so much I'm probably gonna say love throughout this whole video but I really love this powder it's really pigmented you get so much product I had this for a few years now and as you can see I just hit pan in the middle like this lasts a long time it gives you so much color payoff and it sets your skin so nicely and it makes my skin look like my skin and I really love this powder to set under the eyes I love to use this Maybelline fit me powder and this is in the shade medium deep now I was late to this wave um, I heard people talking about it but it took me a while to buy this but guys I do not regret it I love this powder so much um, it's very pigmented it really sets under the eyes nicely now I wouldn't bake with this I don't bake anyway but this isn't really the powder to bake this is really more for a light set under the eyes and I just really really like this powder it's a really nice powder and as you can see I still have a good amount of product left so definitely you should get your hands on this now we're gonna talk about one of my favorite parts of makeup highlight and of course again if you follow me on Instagram you know Fenty Beauty Trophy Wipe is the goat I bought this when the collection first dropped when Fenty Beauty came out with the foundations and all the highlight colors and I knew this was the one I was gonna get and I do not regret buying this this is a pretty gold color with glitter this is intense I always get compliments every time I wear this highlight I love it so much thank you Rihanna for giving the girls what they needed since we're still on face I'm going to talk about these three face brushes so this brush I like to use to set my whole face with with powder and this is a wet and wild powder brush I got this a long time ago as you can see it's dingy and everything but guys I love this so much it's so big it covers a big amount of your face and it's affordable like it's only was like two dollars I believe I got this a while ago 
but I definitely believe it's only like two bucks and it's just a great powder brush so I would definitely get this. For contour or bronzing I like to use this brush now I got this from Aliexpress also a while ago it came in the brush set um again I do not have any of the rest of the brushes but this one stayed and this is what I really like to use to kind of contour and I also like to use it for blush as well and it does a really good job um, very inexpensive and yes just yes <laughs> so the last brush is a highlight brush and as you guys know I love to highlight so this is the elf highlight brush and I'm so glad I got this brush because I haven't had a highlight brush before and I finally bought it like a year ago and I'm glad I did. It really gets the high points of your face really good and it's just nice and tapered and it keeps the product in one place so it's just not flying around everywhere and again this was like only two three dollars elf is undefeated with the brushes so i would get this brush last product for face is blush and this is really like the only blush i have but i love this blush so much so this is the maybelline fit me blush and this is in the color berry day and uh, the color is just right for brown skin girls and it's like a nice berry color like I just love this color so much and it has like a little shimmer into it and I just really like this like this is a really nice blush from Maybelline um, I need to get more into blushes I might try the elf one but if you guys have any favorite blushes that you like just let me know some suggestions below and I'll uh, pick it up and try it Last but not least, we are going to talk about my favorite lip product. So my absolute favorite lip liner is the Queen Cosmetic Lip Liner in Universal. Now this is a brown color and I love this lip liner. It's so smooth. It just glides on like butter and it's really pigmented. I just, I'm wearing it right now. As you can see in this lip combo is killer. And I wear this with like every look. Like there's not a look that I do not wear this with. This is the best lip liner ever. You have to buy this, guys. Obviously, Fenty Beauty Gloss Bomb. This is the original shade. And guys, again, Rihanna really gave the girls what they needed. Because this gloss is my favorite gloss of all time. Definitely. It smells so good and it's so juicy and luscious again I'm wearing it on my lips today and like again this lip combo is killer like I really love this gloss it smells so good I probably already said this but it really does smell so good it smells like candy I have to get the other two I been slacking i've been procrastinating i have to get the other two but this is the best gloss of all time you have to get this you have to if you get nothing else out of this video you have to get this product you know, on to my second favorite gloss so this is from dose of color and this is from the desi and katie collection and this is their over the top gloss and this is a like a glittery gloss it has like gold glitter in it and I love this gloss it's so cute it has a nice glittery sheen not too much glitter not chunky glides on nice uh, and with this lip liner very nice I love this gloss I have to get another one I will get it sometime but I have to get another one of these it's so Good. Last but not least, this lip gloss is from Lucid Beauty, and this is their Shut Eye Lip Gloss in Girl. I love this lip gloss. Um, 
it's also a glittery lip gloss it's not too chunky this is kind of like a brownish gold color and again with the lip liner this brown lip liner it really is so nice i love this company so much i love their glosses i just got their lashes and those are good as well so, and they're also black owned so i would definitely check them out okay loves and that's it for my favorite makeup products i hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and pick some of these products up because they are all amazing subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell if you like my videos and want to be notified when they come out and i'll see you guys in my next video